Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. As many of you know who've used the Google Chrome web browser for desktop now for some time, um, there is an option to search an image by right-clicking on an image and search image with Google Lens, which I have posted on previously. And uh, I did post a video about a month ago uh, when uh, Google Chrome 100 rolled out that in Chrome 100, which was the current stable version at the time of posting that video, and currently we are now on uh, uh, version 102, but when Chrome 100 rolled out for desktop, it got a new updated Google Lens with a couple of new options. And the new Google Lens um, had a bottom tab with three buttons that had been added, which included search text translate and a top tab uh, with find image source to search Google for similar images. And I will leave a link to that video uh, if you're interested, as it will just give you a lot more information. Now, this is just a quick video to keep you updated. If you do use uh, the Google Lens um, option in the Chrome browser on desktop, that um, apparently now uh, your search results and the lens now will work um, in the side panel. So as you might know, the side panel is the little square icon in the top right hand corner of the toolbar, which if you open you can add your reading list and your bookmarks and then you can hide the side panel again. So just to demonstrate, if we just head over back to that image, ABC, search image with Google Lens. Now instead of opening it, opening the search results in a new tab, it's going to open those search results in the side panel as mentioned. And these are the new options uh, that I was mentioning in that previous video. You can find image source, which lets you go find a similar image online. And then obviously you get your main search pertaining to your uh, the, the image that you have searched. And then you can click on text. And if you drag the text from that image into text, uh, it will also then give you a lot of different links pertaining to ABC that you can search through. And then you also have translate, which obviously you can translate if that uh, text is in a different language. Uh, in the image. So those are the options I mentioned in the previous video. But just wanted to let you know now that, um, as mentioned, uh, Google Lens now, these search results can appear and do appear now in the side panel instead of opening up in a new tab. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.